Hey there YouTube, it's Radio again, back with another house build. Let me get rid of my materials from the last one. We're going to do something a little different with this one. So most of these homes have been these pretty large, two-story, well, except for maybe the, the Cape Cod wasn't gigantic, but this next one is a very interesting kind of thing. It's uh, This one is from 19, I think, 35. Um, something I, I've seen and heard about these, but uh, never really looked at any plans of them. So there were these things called Portland Concrete Homes, and they were made out of concrete. They were touted as being fireproof homes. Uh, so we're going to grab a couple of things here, and let's get started with a quick layout. Now, funnily enough, this house here was 12 by 14. The base of this one is also 12 by 14 in a Minecraft sort of scale. So I'm going to start at about here. So go ahead and do 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. And then 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Oh god, lost count. I've got this razor mouse and it just double clicks randomly whenever it feels like it. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14. Alright, so then just bring these all. See, it did it again. Very weird all the way across. Let's connect these up and then go ahead and fill this in with the flooring of your choice. All right, now we've filled in the center. I've just used a standard oak wood flooring. Uh, next little bit we're gonna do is get the uh, little exterior details in here. So if we come around the side, you're gonna wanna come in by one, two. So leave those two empty. Come out by one. And then from here, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six. All right, so then go six back. Two, three, four, five, six. Now what that means is knock out these interior four, fill those in. Next up, come out by two, right there. That is gonna be where the little front porch section starts. And, Let's see, let's count again. We're gonna come over by one, two, three, four. Here on the fourth one, come out by three, and then across by six again. Fill that in, and same deal here. Knock that out. And I realized I made it too wide. Sorry, it's not three out, it is two like so. So that is what that ends up leaving us with. So for this area here, this little front porch kind of area, I just went with like a smooth uh, sandstone material. Uh, we could grab the stairs as well if you wanted. And then just, you know, make a path however you want, straight out to the road. Next up, um, we are going to do the standard like I normally do, four high, and uh, fill in everything, four high around the entire perimeter. All right, and there we go. We've filled everything in, four high, and of course the reason why I've done that is because, you know, this is going to be your roof height right here. Cool. Next up couple little uh, caveats to do here. So this front uh, section that pokes out, fill in that roof like so, and then punch out the middle two rows like this. So that's going to be the first front window area. Then over here is the doorway. We're going to knock out those three. So there's the door. Over on this side, same as the front, except we're going to knock out those two and then cover the top like that. Good, and then that's those. So next we're going to lay out the interior. Uh, so let's just do, uh, let's just do orange <laughs> just for the heck of it. Um, all right, so from here off of this side window, we're going to come right off of that corner. Go one, two, three, four, and five. 
turn around the corner, leave a space, one, two, three, four. Then come into this room, knock out that for a window, knock out that for a window. Then off of this one, come straight across after leaving a gap, straight to the wall. Come into this room here, two off of the corner, knock that out, and then right in the middle. Next one here, put one here, and then draw the wall across like that. Knock out that over there as a window. Then bring this down to, hold on a minute. Something is severely wrong with my plan. Oh dear. Well, isn't that embarrassing? So I made that a little too wide. So it turns out it's actually five wide. Good job counting. So your front should look like that. Oh my god, that's embarrassing. All right, so your front one is five wide, that one is six wide. My fault. Anyway, oh god. So that makes the, the floor layout here. Um, and then of course knock that one out, knock that one out, and then that is a doorway. So again, we could do that. You know, you could put on a small, like a small landing here or something like that. Okay, um, so next order of business, just pull all your walls up to four high, just as we do kind of everywhere else, and then bring the ceiling across and fill in all of this area. All right, now that we have filled all of that in, obviously we're left with, you know, ceiling marks and stuff like that. So the way to cover this up is you're actually going to border everything in a half slab, or sorry, a slab, and then, you know, ultimately you're just going to fill it in with that slab, or if you want to do a different slab in the middle, that's fine. Um, just one detail uh, that was, uh, I noticed on this plan was that there is nothing on top of these sections, so it kind of gives you this sort of look. I don't know, it's really kind of cool, actually. Um, but then go ahead and fill the entire roof up with whatever you know, slab of your choice. Let's go ahead and just address the doors and windows really quickly and we'll wrap this thing up. Um, I'm gonna use the dark glass. Um, what kind of door should we do? Just throw on a spruce door. I'm gonna do, I guess we'll do the spruce as well. Um, just for the extra detail. Actually, let's do that. We're going to put in the stairs that way, put in the door this way. Oh, God, I missed the entryway thing. So there is a entryway sort of little room thing here. You can kind of do this. You don't have to do it if you don't want to, but it's there. It exists. So uh, then, of course, for the rest of this, just start filling these guys in. I love the effect that the uh, the panes create. Like, how cool is that? And then, of course, just go around, fill in the rest. Again, we got another doorway here. Oh, I lost my door. Get my spruce door back. Pop that on. There we go. Window, window, window. Almost done. There we have it. One last little piece of detail you can do is put those up there. And there you go. The 19, what did I say? 35 uh, Portland Concrete Home. Beautiful. Very, uh, very modern design for its time, for sure. Um, but I really like it. It translates well to Minecraft, I think. So there you go. Now with the, the moon coming up, We'll wrap it up there. So until next time, I've been Radio. Take care.